every day we get multiple emails with prayer requests from people all over the world. It comes in to positive Christianity. Every moment of the day and night, every day of the year, prayer requests come in. Always, positive Christianity is praying. Positive Christianity's message to our family, to all the people in the world, is that we are praying with you and for you. Positive Christianity prays with you. And when you pray, know that you've got someone that has your back. We have your back. And God has your back. And we pray with you as you sleep, as you work, as you travel. You need never feel alone or without prayer support. No matter how serious or general your prayer request for yourself or another may seem to you, be assured that it is given our undivided attention and our unceasing prayers. Now, we don't always answer every prayer request. I've told my people it is more important that you pray rather than type an answer. Positive Christianity is praying with you, and you can request prayer by going to our website, positivechristianity.org. We'll start to pray, and we'll pray every day for two continuous months. We know that together we're prayer partners in a cooperation of unceasing and positive prayers. As it says in Romans 1 verse 9, without ceasing, I will mention you always in my prayers. Well, in this moment, we enter into a togetherness of prayer. There is a prayer awareness that we can be physically connected and mentally connected through spiritual prayer. And during this prayer time, we feel this collective spiritual consciousness. People everywhere are joining us right in this moment, together in prayer. And we join together by knowing that God and we are one. We are one with God. This is a prayer time of grateful acceptance. And we give thanks for that glorious truth of God. I ask you to enter into the silence of meditation and know this as true. We're one with the love of God. And in the quiet of this moment, we set aside our concerns and we open our minds and our hearts to the pure love of God out of which we were created and in which we live eternally. We are very grateful for this awareness and we have this awareness solidly inside of ourselves of God's help in every need, in every moment. We're one with the light of God. The light of God shines brightly within us and floods our minds with divine wisdom. We trust our inner knowing, guided by this inner spiritual light of God, which makes our way clear and makes our way smooth. In this light of God, we see new doors of opportunity opening, new doors of understanding opening, and we realize all sense of limitation, and we 
proceed through each door with God courage and God conviction instead of sensing our human limitation alone. You accept this truth for you now. You are one with the life of God. The life of God within you renews you and renews the spiritual connection that you have with God. It moves through every cell, organ, and system to bring you wholeness. In your heart, you envision everyone for whom you pray as strengthened and renewed both in mind and in body. In the stillness of prayer, you see all physical and mental tension dissolve and the way of good health open before you. You rejoice in the transforming energy of God, moving to bring forth strength of body and peace of mind. The life of God renews your mind. It renews your body. You rest in the God-given courage and faith that God gives you in this moment. You are one with the good of God, affirming in prayer abundance all things. You turn your thoughts now to God's prosperity, to the one true source of your good, God. God has richly supplied all creation with bountiful good. You open your mind to the wellspring of divine ideas that flows from deep within. And you receive them to use for the blessing of all. Divine ideas of God reveal new avenues of good for you. Your every need is met in prayer. During this sweet time of prayer and reflection, we have fully felt our oneness with the light and life and love and goodness of God. We are filled with a sense of completeness and we go forth from this sacred moment with a grateful heart. We're renewed and we're ready. We're ready to live more fully in the awareness of our oneness with God. I decree in this moment of your life that the light of God surrounds you. The love of God enfolds you. The power of God protects you. The presence of God watches over you. Wherever you are, God is.